flowing water is considerably superior to still water because it is measurable, controllable, reproducible, effective and pleasant. It opens up new opportunities in therapy and rehabilitation. Obviously, there is the factor that still and flowing water have in common, that is, buoyancy. This is a very important aspect of water. On the other hand, we also have the speed of flow, which imparts dynamic pressure on the body, i.e. a resistance that the body needs to counter. We have increased heat dissipation, which in turn leads to improved circulation of blood, and we have a micro-massage effect, which is visible in the underwater images, where all muscles are very well massaged. Flumes for therapy, rehabilitation and prevention are particularly suitable for inpatient and outpatient rehabilitation establishments. The water of such counter-current systems begins to have an effect at speeds starting from 0.1 meter per second. The specification and recording of the stress involved enables the optimization of treatment. Performance improvements or failures are experienced first-hand by the patient during the course of the exercises. Physical perception and sensory motor sensation can be positively influenced by varying the speed of the water. The comprehensive workout provided to all parts of the body in flowing water enables a degree of performance optimization that is simply not possible or unattainable when training on the bicycle or treadmill.